Welcome to our super fun family dance party. I cannot wait to try out my sweet moves. How about you? We are gonna start this party with some fun music and about halfway through our songs, we will take a break or an intermission to catch our breath and get some water. I might have a little challenge too. Let's go over that Bible verse as a family one last time. Kids, if mom and dad haven't been watching with you, teach them our Bible verse. Are you ready? Okay. Be strong in the Lord and in the strength of his power. Ephesians 6, 10. Great work. See you in a little while.
his shield and sword, but I stand before you in the name of the Lord, yeah. You stand before me with your shield and sword, but I stand before you in the power of the Lord, yeah. Hey, hey, Goliath. I'm sweating from all this great fun. I know I need to stay hydrated, so I'm gonna get some water. Whew, and catch my breath so I can enjoy the rest of this dance party with you. We will return in about five minutes with our next song, but in the meantime, I'm gonna ask you those trivia questions from the week again. Let's see what you remember. Here goes. King Nebuchadnezzar ordered the people to bow to the golden statue whenever A, they were hungry, B, they heard music, C, they were sleeping, or D, they were in school. Do, 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 do. That's right, it was B, they heard music. Now, number two. The banner verse is found in, this one's silly. A, the dictionary, B, the ocean, C, the Bible, Ephesians 6.10, or D, cartoons. I know everybody's going to get this one right. It's C, the Bible, Ephesians 6.10. Number three, knights need to know how to A, make pizza, B, play soccer, three, paint fences, or D, ride horses. I'll give you a second. Do, 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 do. That's right. They need to learn how to ride horses. Number four. David went into battle against Goliath with A, the king's armor, B, a sandwich and an apple, C, a sling and five small stones, or D, his best friend. While it would be cool to go into battle with your best friend, I don't think that's the right answer. And he definitely didn't go with the king's armor, right? And who goes to battle with a sandwich and an apple? Nobody. Except maybe Shaggy and Scooby. They might take a sandwich and an apple to a battle. While they hide, of course. So it's C, a sling and five small stones. Number five. To become a knight, one must first become a page and then a B whole book, B, squire, C, police officer, or D, baker? The answer is B, the squire. Number five, 
To become a knight, one must first become a page and then a... A, a whole book. B, a squire. C, a police officer. Or C, D, a baker. Number five. To become a knight, one must first become a page and then an A, a whole book. A B, a squire. Number five. To become a knight, one must first become a page and then a... A, a whole book. B, a squire. C, a police officer, or D, a baker. Do, 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 do. The answer is B, squire. Number six, our banner verse says, oh, everybody better know this one. Be strong in the Lord and in the strength of his, A, power, B, army, C, horses, or D, iceberg. Yes, that's right, it's A, power. Number seven, Mary and Joseph went to Bethlehem, A, for a vacation, B, to watch a soccer game, C, because Bethlehem has great tacos, D, so the king could count people. I don't know about you, but I love tacos, but that's not the reason that they went. They definitely didn't go for a vacation, and I don't even know that they played soccer back then, so the answer is D, so the king could count people. It was called a census. We still do those today. Number eight, a knight's full suit of armor usually weighs about A, the same as a hamburger, B, the same as a feather, C, 50 pounds, or D, the same as three llamas. I don't know about you, but three llamas would be heavy. I kind of wear that. A hamburger, I think it probably weighs more than that. And a feather. Well, a feather's lighter than a hamburger, so I'm gonna have to go with C, 50 pounds. Number nine, a turret is something purchased on vacation, a small castle used as a lookout, a very small car, or a small colorful bird that likes to walk in water. Hmm, a turret. I feel like the armor and Sparky taught us about this, but I have to remember. Oh yeah, it's a small castle used as a lookout. All right, number 11. Only two more questions to go. Paul and Silas's prison doors flew open in the middle of the night because A, they were well oiled, B, it was windy, C, the jailer was trying to catch a mouse, or D, from an earthquake. That reminds me of that song. When the ground moves, when the earth shakes, got me feeling out, feeling like an earthquake. Na, 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 na. That was a fun song, wasn't it? Oh, I just told you the answer. It was from an earthquake. Number 12. What is a bow and scrape? Hmm. A delicious way to cook eggs. When two knights bow and hit heads, that's silly. Bowing with one leg behind. Aww. Or a scratch on the front of a boat. Hmm. We have to think back to our lesson from yesterday. It is bowing with one leg behind, kind of like a curtsy bow. Well, that was a fun intermission. Now, let's get back to our dance party.
Jesus loves me.